Hey, fellow traders, so should you invest in a trading algorithm or not? Okay, that is the topic for today's video. Okay, I'm sure you've seen a lot of uh, training algos that are out there. Okay, this is the algo that we are working with. Right, you've seen a lot of trading algorithms that have outperformed the market and uh, you want a piece of uh, these algorithms. Okay, but the question is, should you be investing in uh, this kind of algorithms? And if yes, let's say you were to do it, what should you be looking out for? Okay, so that's what I'll be covering in today's video. Okay, before I get into uh, the breakdown of what I'll be covering today, I uh, just want to make a disclaimer that yes, uh, we are promoting this uh, algorithm, this mean reversion algorithm as what you see over here. But the purpose of this video today is not to sell you this algorithm, okay? You can look for any other algorithms you want. You can go onto other websites, look for other people. There's no problem at all, okay? The goal of today's video is we want to educate you as to whether you should invest in the algorithm and the things that you need to watch out for, okay? We've seen a lot of scams out there. A lot of people lost a lot of money, right? They invest money in some algorithm. You know, there's a lot of fake YouTube comments on our channel as well that, you know, tells you that, oh, this account manager made a lot of money and all this kind of bullshit. Okay, so that is the purpose of today's video. Okay, we want to address that and hopefully just educate you about how to approach uh, this kind of investment and what you should look out for. Okay, so hopefully that is clear. Now, in today's video, I want to talk about when you should invest in a trading, trading algorithm. Okay, as I mentioned, my job is to educate you. I'm not just going to tell you that you should invest in a trading algorithm if you know just because we, you know, we want you to invest with us. But I want to tell you that there are situations where you should invest and there are situations where you should not invest. Okay, so depending on where you are, uh, you, you have to evaluate whether investing in a trading algorithm is the right decision for you. Okay, so the first part of today's video, I want to do just that. I want to show you uh, if you should invest in a trading algorithm and when you should not invest in a trading algorithm. Then I want to go to the crucial part of uh, this video, which is how do you avoid forex scams? Okay, what should you look out for? Right, what are some you know things that a lot of people do not know, and therefore uh, they lose a lot of, of money when they put money with all this you know, uh, YouTube comments down below our channel. You know, like they say, oh, we turn one thousand five thousand in three days. All these kind of scams out there. Okay, so I want to help you uh, avoid uh, losing money. Okay, at the end of the day, uh, if you decide that it's not for you, uh, algorithm is not a way for you, right? Just make sure that uh, your money is safe. Okay, that's the priority for today's video. Okay, I really do not care whether you put money with us, you put money anywhere. Just do not lose your money. Just be careful with your money. Okay, it is your hard earned money. Okay, now by the way, if you're new to this channel, really appreciate if you just take three seconds to like our video. Okay, it will help us a lot. We're trying to grow to a hit 100,000 traders. We're right? trying to impact 100,000 traders. Okay, so at the same time, please turn on the subscribe button, turn on the notification bell because we create a lot of videos like this to help help you not just in your trading but if let's say you want to invest in all this kind of trading algorithm we want to help you out okay we want to make sure that uh, you make the best decision possible and i hope you can sense that i'm really very sincere in helping you i'm not here to sell you but i'm really here uh, to give you the best information that you can have to make the right decisions uh, regarding uh, what you want to do with your money okay we also have a free day trading guide uh, you can download it anytime after this video. Okay, it's free. There's no credit card required. So there's no catch. So that is also a very uh, good guide which uh, walks you through the basics of uh, trading as well as a step-by-step -step trading strategy. So check that out at your own time. So let's talk about the first uh, topic for today or first you know, uh, agenda for today, whether when you should invest in a trading algorithm. Okay, if you are one of those traders who seriously you tried all sorts of trading strategies, right? You, you, you attended 10 trading courses like us, you try and you keep failing. And more importantly, you find that you're unable to stick to one, okay? I.e. meaning that you are always system hopping. Maybe for a week, uh, you see that our signals are doing well and you know, you trade our signals for one week and the next week, maybe our signals lose money and you just ditch our signal and you go to another signal provider. Okay, if this is you, then it is very likely that uh, it is because of your emotions. 
which makes it difficult for you to turn a profit uh, when you are trading. Okay, it's not so much about the trading strategy, but it is your emotions. And when you are in this kind of scenario, it is better for you to invest in a trading algorithm which has no emotions. You put the money there and you let the algorithm emotional without execute your trades without any emotions right because it's just a trading robot that doesn't matter whether the account is up or down there's no excitement there's no greed there's no fear it just executes the trade okay so this is the first scenario where you want to invest in a trading algorithm okay the second thing is when you discover that uh, your trading psychology or emotion is the reason you are losing money Okay, for, perhaps you've seen uh, us make a lot of money, you've seen that our signals work, but somehow you realize that you're just not able to follow our signals because you know you hesitate, uh, you do not size your position correctly, or you know you you just do things that you shouldn't be doing. This is also an instance where you do not want to uh, be trading on your own manually. In this case, in this case, it is your emotions which is the problem. Okay, so you want to stick to an algorithm. Now earlier. This week or sometime last week, I created a video talking about the truth about demo trading. So in that video, I talk about something called the demo live account uh, gap analysis. Okay, so what I will do is I will leave a link. Uh, I will leave a link to this video at the top right. Okay, if you have not watched that video, the demo live account gap analysis is a tool that you can use to pinpoint whether your trading strategy or trading psychology is the problem. Okay, so of course, if you discover that your trading psychology is the problem, then investing in a trading algorithm is going to be uh, a good decision for you. Okay, so that's just a brief uh, you know, introduction of what this demo live account uh, gap analysis is. But uh, just feel free to check that out after this video. Okay, I'll leave it at the top right and I'll leave the link in the description. So you can check that out after watching uh, this video. Okay. So when should you not invest in a trading algorithm? Okay, if you are a control freak, okay, nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that. If you want total control and you cannot give up control, okay, you are just that kind of person. Uh, you 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 don't like the idea that uh things are managing your hard earned money, right? You work so hard to make the money, and some algorithm is managing your money, and you cannot control. Uh, then obviously investing in a trading algorithm is not for you, because. When you invest in a trading al algorithm, you are going to be giving up control. You have to give up control because after all, you want the algorithm uh, to trade for you. So you are actually giving this algorithm the power to trade for you. So naturally, that means that you will give up some control. So if you are not comfortable with that, then uh, unfortunately, investing in a trading algorithm is not for you. And that's totally fine. Okay, I'm not saying that you have to trade in it. You have to invest in the trading algorithm to make money. There are many discretionary traders out there who make money. In fact, our signals are discretionary in nature. Okay, but I'm not, I'm not saying that you need to trade in al trading algorithm, but I'm just saying that uh, if you are this kind of personality, if this is your situation, uh, then it's better that you not invest in a trading uh, algorithm. The other situation is, of course, uh, it goes without saying, is if you have no money, okay? I just want to be blunt. I want to be uh, straight up with you. Okay, if you have no money and you can't afford to lose money, let's say your bank account has, has $500 and you are trying to turn $500 to make a monthly income for your family, please do not trade, okay? Do not even talk about trading algorithm. Don't even talk about trading. You should not even be trading, okay? When it comes to trading, you always want to be risking money that you can afford to lose, okay? I'm going to say this one more time because it's so important. I, I don't want you to be in a bad financial situation, okay? Please do not invest money that you cannot afford to lose. If you have no money, go and get a job, get some form of income in first, have your finances you know, set it before looking at trading or before even considering investing in a trading algorithm, okay? Trading is not the way out of uh, your, you know, of your financial situation. Trading is a way to enhance your financial situation, to improve your quality of life, but it is not a good way for you to, uh, you know, turn $500 to $1 million and have all the pressure on you, okay? Because what happens is that when you have the pressure to trade, meaning that you need to make money, most of the time you're going to make bad decisions because you are trying to force a trade because you need to make the money. 
Conversely, if let's say uh, you do not need the money and you have a day, day job and you have income coming in, you can wait patiently for the market to come to you before uh, you take a trade. So that is the difference. Okay, So please do not invest money uh, that you can't afford to lose. Now let's move on to the last part of today's video is how do you avoid forex scams and what to look out for. Okay, The first golden rule that I have for you, which is also the most important rule, is that never, 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 never transfer money out. Okay, what do I mean by this? Okay, this is very important. Okay, any investment you do, always never transfer the money out. Meaning that let's say you want to invest in an algorithm or you want to do some for investment, do not transfer the money out to the person's bank account. Because when you do that, you lose control of your money. Okay, the person can run away with your money. You don't know what he does with your money. And that's where uh, it gets very risky. Okay, you do not know what's going on and it's highly likely that uh, you've been scammed. Okay, so never transfer money out. Always insist on uh, retaining control of your money. Okay, how you do that is that you deposit your investment into your own trading account. Okay, this is very important. Your own trading account where the money still belongs to you. Meaning that uh, whatever money is in a trading account, let's say it's 2,000, 5,000, it still belongs to you. The money is legal tender to you. Okay, if let's say you withdraw the money, uh, it goes from the brokerage, uh, account to your bank account. Okay, it doesn't cross into another person's uh ownership. Okay, it doesn't mean like um this account manager uh takes the money into his MT4 and start trading. Okay, never do that. A lot of our YouTube comments, spam comments that we get. Okay, we do our best to delete those so that you do not see it. But we receive a lot of this kind of stupid comments every single day. Comments such as oh um. Uh, I've been losing money for the past 10 years, but uh, you know, when I met Mr. Henry at then they put their the person's uh, contact number or email address over there, right? And then they hope that you contact this guy and then you get scammed. Okay, we delete all these comments, hopefully you don't see it. But there are a lot of comments like this, uh, not just on our channel, but on other people's channel as well. So just make sure you never transfer money out. Okay, the second thing that you want to watch out for is you want to make sure that every single position has a stop loss meaning that uh, they are cutting their losses short, okay? And more importantly, also make sure that the entire algorithm has an emergency stop loss, okay? This one should be an emergency stop loss, sorry for that. But what do I mean by uh, emergency stop loss? What I mean is that let's say, uh, let's say you invest $1,000, uh, let's say you have an emergency stop loss at 30%, that means if your account were to drop below $700, then the algorithm will stop trading for you. That's an emergency stop loss. It's also known as a hard stop loss, meaning that uh, the moment that level is triggered, uh, the algorithm will not take any more trades for your account. Okay, This is very important to preserve your capital and ensure that you do not lose 100% of your uh, trading account. Okay, the other thing you also want to take note is that each of your posi positions should have a uh, decent risk, meaning you're not risking 20% per trade. You want to look at the risk, the position size of uh, each trade that is being taken. Okay, I didn't write that down there, but uh, you can just, uh, you know, just take note of that. Now, the next thing you want to focus on is you also want to look at verified trade records. You don't want to hear say, you want to see, okay? You have to see that that this algorithm is really doing well. You do not want to hear from a friend. You do not want to get scammed by you know, some account manager saying that it's doing well without showing you any proof. Okay, The proof that we have over here, it's uh, at the start of this video. This is a verified record. If you go to the MyFX book at the top section, you can, over here, Okay, this is a screenshot, but uh, maybe let me just show it to you over here. Okay, you can see that there is a tr trade records verified, trading privileges verified. You want to always insist on verified records. Okay, this is very important because uh, people can always, uh, you know, like they can always Photoshop uh, the results or they can, uh, you know, edit the results or take another person's results and, uh, you know, say that that's their results, okay? So you want to make sure that you see with your uh, eyeballs, you want to eyeball it and make sure that uh, there's verified trade results okay the last thing that i want you to pay attention to would be look at the downside do not just get excited because of the upside you know there are a lot of people they see these returns they see that our algorithm has done really well has gone 800 plus percent and they get all excited about it and they ignore the rest okay please do not do that okay even if you are very keen on investing in our algo Please, okay, please really look through it, okay, because my job here is to educate you, okay, as I said, my job here is not to sell you, my job is really to serve you. 
So please look at the historical drawdown. Okay, in this case, the historical drawdown is about um 22.51%. So ask yourself, is this drawdown something that you can tolerate uh, psychologically? Is a 20% drawdown too much for you? Okay, this is a question that only you can answer, but you need to know the numbers first. Before you make an investment, you need to know this. Okay, the other thing that I want you to pay attention to is the risk of ruin, okay, which is over here. Okay, again, all these are provided at myfxbook.com. So uh, whenever you are looking at a trading algorithm, ask that person to upload his training records to my FX book and have a look at all this, okay? In our case, we have provided you this verified uh, trade records on our website, okay? We leave a link in the description for you to check out if you are keen. But if you are not keen, that's fine, okay? I just want to take you through the process, okay? So this risk of ruin, you can see that um, uh, the probability of you losing 30% uh, of your account is very small. You can see over here, it's super small, okay? In fact, the probability of you losing 10% of your account is only 1%. So in this kind of scenario, since the risk is so small, uh, technically it is very safe, okay? So this is something that you want to pay attention to. You want to always pay attention to your downside, okay? Please do not get carried away with just the upside of, uh, you know, 800% and then you get all excited over here without looking at the downside, okay? Always pay attention to your downside because if you pay attention to your downside, the upside will take care of itself, okay? That's a very good uh, trading principle that I hope you catch, okay? If you take care of your downside, the upside will take care of itself. So just a recap of what I covered today. Today, I talked about when you should invest in a trading algorithm, okay? Basically, uh, you're emotional. Uh, maybe you don't have time to trade. Uh, you cannot follow a trade because of your psychology. Uh, you are unable to stick to a system or you keep system hopping. Then it's better that uh, you do the uh, trading algorithm, okay? If you do the... Uh, demo live account uh, gap analysis and you find that your trading psychology is the problem, then uh, you should uh, invest in a trading algorithm, okay? You should not invest in a trading algorithm if uh, you, you know, you don't have money to lose or you want control, okay? You are control freak, uh, okay? N nothing wrong with that, right? Nothing wrong with that. You like control and uh, you do not like to uh, give a robot uh, to manage your money. So that's when you should not invest in a trading algo. And lastly, I talk about how do you avoid forex scams. Okay, you always want to make sure that uh, the money, uh, you retain ownership of your money, right? The money is in your brokerage account and doesn't transfer out. Okay, you also want to look at the drawdown, the risk of ruin. And of course, you want to look at the returns and ask yourself if uh, this is a algorithm that is doing well. Okay, that goes without saying. Uh, so always look for verified records. Okay, if you have any other questions regarding our algorithm or you know other people's algorithm, you want us to do a review, want us to take a look, please just leave a comment down below. We love to help you. Okay, the last thing we want to hear from you is that uh, you got scammed and then you lost XXX amount because uh, you didn't watch this video or because uh, you didn't pay attention to you know uh, what we say in this video. Okay, we really do not want you to lose money. Okay, money is very hard to earn. Okay, it's so your hard earned money. So we really want to make sure that you protect your capital and that is the goal of today's video. Okay, so I hope you've gotten value out of this video. Remember, right, to give us a thumbs up, right, if you benefited from this video, right, subscribe to this channel because we create videos like this and we generally want to serve you, okay? So hopefully you can feel that I'm really very passionate about serving you. I really want the best for you. So if you have any questions, just leave a comment down below. If not, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.